Check it out, guys. Look what I got. Got a pallet. I don't know if you guys can guess what this is. The pallet was full a second ago. I'm just putting them in here for now. Let's open one of these up. I think I got this one open right here. Got a whole pallet of these batteries here. Some battery hookup. But 96 of these 100 amp hour modules. And we're going to do a huge solar install with these. I believe it's 30 kilowatts here. Well, it's winter here in Canada. Snow on everything. Snow in the house trailer. We got, uh, I already cleaned those panels. I still got to clean those panels. And these panels, and I already cleaned. Let's see if I can make my way up here. It's a metal roof. It's very slippery. Got to step on the screws. Let's see, we got the house trailer deployed. We got some family staying in there. Just for the weekend, we got uh, my solar panels on that side there. They're all cleaned off. Batteries went dead last night because I was running a heater, electric heater, uh, in, the, in the house trailer. And I was running everything inside the house and stuff. And so at about six in the morning, they went dead. I didn't go dead. They had the war warning dead beep. So before they actually go dead, <coughs> so I went and turned the heater off and I'm sitting at 53 volts, which is really low for my battery bank. And so I'm sweeping off the panels to get charged and uh, yeah, we don't have a super nice day today, unfortunately. I wish it was a little sunnier, but there is some, some breaks in the clouds, so maybe we'll get some sun today and I'll be able to charge my batteries a bit. Anyways. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. And now, with all the snow off the panels, we are making 1100 there, 870 there, and on the other side, over here, we are making 400. So we're not doing too bad. We're making a bit of power. Voltage is coming up. Gentry Solar is doing amazing. I'm just using this one uh, throughout the winter because I don't use as much power in the winter. I don't use the electric dryer off-grid in the winter just because most of the time I don't have enough power through December and January especially. don't have enough power. February start making quite a bit more power again. But uh, there you have it. There's the count on the hours and the kilowatt hours produced. I'm just giving the old Magna signs here a nice little rest. You're just sitting in the off position. Anyways, just an update on what I'm doing. Hope you guys enjoyed the video.